So if you guys don't remember, I've actually been on YouTube for close to five or six years now, and as you can see, about three months ago, I I wa I made a video called "Rewatching Past Collab Videos: Blockhead, Mr. Pulse, uh, Nevin Gaming, so on and so forth." A while ago, maybe like two to th maybe like even about two years ago, I recorded a lot of my videos with at least one or two other people sometimes even as much as three to four other people and it was me and a group of our friends and we used to play a lot of games together and we used to record a lot of videos together and it was really nice so lately i've been doing things more myself and now i'm starting to regain some of my subscriber viewer base because i'm starting to create a schedule and come back now i feel that i'm ready to open back up to collabs a while ago, I'd say maybe four or five years ago, I used to watch Team Crafted. Now, as you know, Team Crafted was on, yeah, like six, seven years ago. And they were all really good friends. And they all lived together. And they all played a lot of games together. And they really enjoyed their time together. And when they all collabed, their viewer base exploded because they were all collabing and sharing with each other. And this was an amazing Minecraft. And this was an amazing team of just people who just loved to play Minecraft. And it was really fun. Uh, they eventually went away when they all broke off and decided to do different things, but now we have more groups of people like Call Me Carson, if you don't want to call me, call, call me Carson, which is just a, a, basically a comedy YouTube channel who does some gaming. Now, he does videos with like 10 to 15 people at a time, a lot of people, and he can get his viewer base exploding because he does all these different collabs. And it really works out for a lot of these people, but I'm wonder but what I'm wondering is why don't more people do this? And the thing is is that a lot of people don't do things like this. A lot of small YouTubers, in fact, don't do things like this. Now when Team Crafted left and and uh they decided to split up, it didn't really seem like many people um decided to take their place. It was still just small maybe small groups of YouTubers decided to make their own teams and that just popped up like that, but that's not how it should work. It shouldn't just be another team of five to six people. It should be more of a community of Minecraft YouTubers. It seems that a lot of big, big channels, they all talk to each other and collab frequently and are able to communicate properly with each other because they're all big and they don't really need to uh, fight with each other to get a spot. They already have their spot. So now all they're doing is trying to keep their spot by communicating with each other and by doing collabs and making sure the channel grows properly. And this is the proper business way of doing things. But small YouTubers seem to be constantly battling with each other or sticking to their small friend group, sticking to what they know and, and dueling it out that way. What I think is, is that we can grow our viewer basis, all of us, faster is if instead of us battling with each other in our small friend groups, we instead diversify and increase our increase our groups to like eight to ten people at a time. Really get out there, get really big. And we shouldn't be stumbling and saying no to the smaller channels who have like a hundred less. We should be bringing them in as well because those people could get really good views and start to explode and then they could take you along with them if you're just a struggling channel with a 1400 subscribers like me i think that it'd be really really nice to be able to collaborate with large groups of people and that's what i'm trying to do I've been trying to get into contact with many YouTubers who share the same types of videos that I do, whether it be Minecraft in many different aspects, whether it be building Minecraft or animations or or vanilla survival, anything, as long as it's compatible with what I'm doing, that being on, on the computer. And I think it'd be good to diversify everything. I do mostly a lot of modded stuff, as you can see. I do a lot of... Uh, I, I do either real world modding where I mod my own self to be able to fit Minecraft or I mod Minecraft to be able to fit my own needs and maybe it's good if I could diversify into other things as well. Um, so what I'm trying to say here is contact me if you want to collab. I, I want to get as many people as possible in and I want to have a community of YouTubers where we can all communicate with each other and we can all collab with each other. Maybe where there's like 20 or 30 different YouTubers all talking to each other. And we all have the ability to say, hey, I want to collab on a video. Can I get five or six other five or six other people who would like to go ahead and do this with me? And then they can go ahead and do that. Five or six other people can join in. We can all gain subscribers all equally and all much quicker than we, than we generally could otherwise. 
collaborations aren't something to not enjoy or not to be uh, excited about. It's perfect to get your name out there, to get other people's names out there. It's a win-win situation in all accounts. So please, it doesn't matter how many subscribers you have, whether it be a thousand subscribers or even 15, I don't care. Go ahead and contact me. Uh, subs go ahead and go to my Discord. Go ahead and just comment on this video, and I'll even link you my Discord if you can't find it. Though it is right here in the corner. You can go to the About section, and you can just join in my Discord right there, and then just message me privately. I'm the owner of the Discord, and I'm usually always on, so you can just private message me whenever, and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you don't, uh, if you uh, don't mind subscribing and watch a couple more of my videos, see how you like it, then um, I, I would appreciate if you could do that. And uh, I'll see you guys next time.